Hello, it's uh, Dave Madden here with JB Industries. I want to spend a few moments to go over at a higher level our wireless product offering. First, let's take a look at our wireless digital manifolds. Well, they actually come in two flavors. One is the revolver brass ball valve manifold. The other is an aluminum piston style design. Now, why would one choose a ball valve over a piston? Some of it's personal preference. Some people like the quarter turn open close of a ball valve. Some like the piston reliability and ability to throttle refrigerant in. Um, some just like aluminum, a little lighter weight than forged brass. But there's a bigger difference. The revolver has a built-in liquid metering device. So it has a specially designed ball. So when you turn to the first notch on this handle, it actually replicates a liquid charging adapter. So if you're charging high glide zeotropic blends that must be charged as a liquid, but you don't want to damage the compressor, this may be the manifold for you. Other than the manifold body itself, the manifolds share the same head, all right? So they have the transflective e-paper display, which is really readable in bright sunlight. Oftentimes, many times, these are used outdoors. And with a burned-in display, uh, segmented display, the display gets washed out. So instead of seeing the numbers that you need, all you see is everything that was ever burned into that board. Another great feature of this manifold are the transducers themselves. I mean, why use a digital manifold in the first place? There are several reasons. Probably the most important one is accuracy. Analog gauges, on average, have about a 2 to 3% accuracy on the board on tube analog gauges. Digital transducers are about 0.25% accurate. So much more accurate which is important for critically charged systems. You don't want your superheat or a subcoin to be off by a few degrees. Another key component of our digital manifolds is robustness. Many people fear going from analog to digital means they have to sacrifice quality. We've gone to great lengths to protect these transducers. They are stainless steel and they're laser welded. So once they're screwed in that manifold, there is really no way for the refrigerant to abuse the transducers. Some other designs use a disc with a protective O-ring to conceal that, but that O-ring's not gonna last forever. So we feel very confident in the longevity and the robustness of these digital manifolds. Other great features of this manifold include a really in-depth menu. From the display alone, you can go in and recalibrate your temperature sensors. You can recalibrate or adjust your pressure readings. Uh, there's a zero button right on here and Every available refrigerant is built into here. Unlike board on tube analog gauges where you have to grab a different set for every different refrigerant or pull out a different PT chart, you simply click the up and down arrows to activate the PT chart for that specific refrigerant you're working on. Our digital manifolds also come in a super hard carrying case that allow you to keep the hoses attached to the manifold. They hang through the case. You can hang it up in your truck or lay it down. And it does come with a four hose set with every digital manifold. Like all of our wireless products, the digital manifold is a standalone product, but it also is wireless and connects to an app. So again, the JB Go app, that's free on the App Store or Google Play, can be downloaded and used with your digital manifold. And that gives you some other features such as logging or trending. Now what's really exciting about our wireless line of products is they all can be used, used standalone. They all have displays, they all have OLED displays. They can work directly with an app. So if I just want a temperature clamp reading, I can just use the app for that. If I just want a wet bulb or relative humidity, I can use the psychrometer, connect to the app for that. If I've paired them to my digital manifold, as soon as I turn my manifold on and my clamps and psychrometers, they automatically connect every single time. So there's really no setup, it's very easy to use. One great thing about our digital wireless manifolds is they connect with our other wireless products. So right now, the temperature clamps that are wireless, psychrometers are wireless, are automatically reporting to the digital manifold. So I'm not tethered by a six foot temperature clamp like I was in the past. Now you can still use K-type thermocouples if you're close, um, but more and more people are going to the wireless clamps and psychrometers for that flexibility. Now, alternatively, if you don't want to use a manifold, you can use the pressure probes from JB Industries. So they take the place of a manifold, essentially. 
You put these on your high and low side. They have a charging port. They have a display. Again, all of our wireless products have their own display and can be used standalone without an app. They're designed to be used for the app, but they can be used without an app. So you could use pressure probes in conjunction with psychrometers and temperature clamps as well. Psychrometers are a similar looking design with a similar OLED display. They have a twist cap, so you can open up to get maximum airflow for proper dew point relative humidity readings. And it's a red cap, so it shows you when it's closed or not. It's got a very strong magnet to hang up on the vents or on the plenum to get your dew point, relative humidity, whatever uh, readings you need from your psychrometer. And the temperature clamps, similar OLED display design, open up very large, two and an eighth inch uh, pipes can be accommodated with the wireless temperature clamps. Again, they can all be used in conjunction. You can use one for a quick reading. You can hook them all up, and many more than this even, if you're on a large job and you need a lot of diagnostic uh, reading points. Um, so they all connect to an app that's free, available from uh, the App Store, Google Play, JB Go. Uh, all of these products that I've talked about are also all fully compatible with MeasureQuick. So if you're already a MeasureQuick user and maybe use some other devices, you can start to incorporate JB's devices into that enterprise. Now that I've provided a very high level overview of these wireless products, let's go outside and hook them up. Now we're outside by our condensing unit. And as you can see, we have our wireless digital manifold hooked up in a more conventional manner to the high and low side using hoses. So the pressure transducers in the wireless manifold itself are reading the pressure. It's calculating your saturation temperatures. We have wireless temperature clamps and wireless psychrometers in their appropriate locations that are reporting wirelessly back to the digital manifold. So if you look close at the wireless digital manifold display, you'll see all the pertinent information. Pressure, sat temperature, your superheat subcooling values, your indoor wet bulb values are all reporting to the digital manifold. Now, the other way we talked about hooking up is using pressure probes, which can all also connect wirelessly to the app. Even though we are hooked up through a mechanical manifold, the manifold still is wireless and still connects to an app. That app will give you trending, it'll allow you to log, and a bunch of other more advanced features. So like our other wireless products, it can be used standalone, it can be used in conjunction with wireless temperature clamps and psychrometers as we're showing now, or it could be connected to our JB Go app. I talked about the transflective display, but out here in this bright sunshine, you can really see how clear it really is. It reads better the brighter the sunshine. We also have a reverse mode display. So if the display is not to your liking on that particular day, you can reverse the mode. For more information on these wireless products and many more, please visit jbind.com and subscribe to our YouTube channel.